All right, gamers. It's the moment we've all been dreading since the announcement, like, I don't know, two years ago, a Flash ending. It's gone officially. You open a Flash player in your browser and it just doesn't work. It, all of the memories of going to unblocked games at school or playing Club Penguin proper is just gone. You need a downloadable client for most CPPSs now or some are HTML5, but it's just not the same. Now, fortunately, your boy Anvura found a fix for Windows. This is for Windows only, by the way, okay? So, you're gonna go into the description of this video. You're gonna download the file, all right? And when you do that, you're gonna find in it a README, which just directs you to my channel and tells you to find the instructions of how to use it there. You're gonna have an uninstaller and you're gonna have a proper flash version, okay? And underneath, not in the readme, but like in the description, I mean, there's gonna be a few directories you're gonna have to go to and restart your computer. So when you restart your computer, you're gonna want to come back to this video, otherwise you're just gonna not have flash installed. So when you, when it should be saved in your history though, so you should be able to find it. First of all, you're gonna to wanna to close all of your Chromes, your Firefoxes, your Internet Explorer, like any browser you have open that uses Flash, you wanna close it. Well, here we go. So you wanna uninstall your Flash player, okay? It's gonna pop up this nice little window and all you're gonna to wanna to do is just click uninstall, okay? There we go, now it's uninstalling. And it says, please restart. All right, gamers. So I just restarted my PC. And so you wanna click on this flash player, right? And you're gonna click yes when it brings up the little window. And you're gonna say you read the agreement. I mean, you can click on it and read it. Most important step, click never check for updates because then it's gonna tell you to uninstall and update it. So you wanna click that. And then now we're done with this file, okay? So what we're gonna do now is we're gonna press Windows E on our keyboard. And you're gonna take the first directory in the description and put it in this address bar. It's gonna take you here. You're gonna copy this file, all right? And then you're gonna go into this directory you may have a folder here like me so you just want to go into that folder and then you're just gonna delete this but now we're gonna paste it in and you're just gonna name this the same way the other one was named which is just like that and now you should be done should just be able to run like normal like that well guys if you enjoyed this video you know what to do smash the like button subscribe and i'll see y'all in the next video peace <laughs>